Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. I know that I haven't did a cooking video in a while, but today I'm making low carb tacos, well, a taco casserole. So I'm gonna show y'all everything I got. Like, I'm cooking for five. Yeah, I'm cooking for five. So I got these. It was one dollar and fifty cent at Walmart. It already ha already has the seasoning in it, so I really don't have to, you know, add any seasoning to this. And it's seasoned good. I had this before. So I got two packs of this. Only $1.50 at Walmart. And it's a great substitute for ground beef. I got me some tomatoes. And I cut up an onion. Just ignore how I chopped it up. It's, you know, it's all going to be mixed together. And I got this cheese. For Esther blend cheese. And I also got some sour cream and taco sauce. You know. <laughs> Even though I don't need the seasoning, I'm still going to add some taco sauce to it. Mm-hmm. Yeah, back to that. And y'all, this is why I say I ain't really gonna add no seasoning because look at all this seasoning. Like it's seasoning pretty well. Now I'm finna add my and like I said, don't mind how I just cut these onions up, honey, cause listen. And if you ain't doing like the the low carb or whatever, you know, that I'm doing, add whatever you want into it. I know some people put black beans and all that type of stuff. So like I said, add what you want. This is just like a low carb way. Ooh, my camera's blue. smoke. But while this cooking, I'm going to go ahead and set my oven to preheat it to 350 degrees. And I'm going to show y'all how I'm going to set up the casserole. Okay, as y'all can see, I had added oil in the the tortillas but y'all don't have to do that i prefer y'all not to do that but since this was my first time making it i thought that i would like it like that but i don't because it gets kind of greasy so for y'all first step i just suggest y'all to just start layering it with meat do not add the tortillas Here's how the layer looks, but anyway, time to add some more cheese. And then cheese everywhere. And remember, I only have two layers. So the first time I put it down, I added tortillas, but I didn't use, only use tortillas for the bottom base. And I used two and I cut them in half. Okay, there should be enough cheese. Now I'm going to put some tomatoes and parsley. Just gonna put like a little tomatoes. Like I said, cut them how you want to cut them. I ain't good at cutting up anything. Keep going. Okay, hold on, let me put the parsley. This kind of parsley I'm using, regular dried up parsley. Just to give it some color because it was just like, girl, you know how people just put parsley on anything to make it look good. Yeah, this gonna look good. Okay, it's finally done. It took about, I let it sit on 350 for like 10 to 15 minutes. Oh, yeah, a little casserole. And like I said, you can add or take away for whatever you want. 
you know, making sure I don't see I am on a low carb keto diet, so that's why I didn't add too much. But yeah, add what y'all want. This just like so, something simple and easy that you can do, like I always say.